obviously, this is old school game, Hangman. Uh, but the thing that I really like about this game in particular is that it's instant and easy and it's low prep. And I think this version I have in, I think this is in English where my thinking is it's not only fun and low prep, if you've got, you know, sort of five minutes, seven minutes, you want to review something that would otherwise not be that much fun, you can do this. Um, but I have a bunch that are actually also in Spanish. So I think it's a really fun way to learn review the target language alphabet. And, you know, we're always doing that in our language classes where, you know, we're using the alphabet, um, but they, you know, as much exposure as they can get to it, that's, is really great. And this is a fun way to do it. It's having it on the, the pre-printed sheet, I think. So just having a bunch of these, maybe put them in the back of your room or wherever it is that, that got them ready to go and students can play with just a little bit of notice. Let's see. Um, I think this one works really well for, um, most of the time. This um, I would use this one sort of display up on a board um, or even print it out and laminate it. Uh, so if you want access to this template and this template, and I also have a bunch in Spanish as well as uh, tons of other templates, uh, you can find them in... The description box. We have a print version of this in my book, Building Proficiency for World Language Learners, 100 Plus High Interest Activities, which I published with Routledge in April of 2024. And we have some digital offers, ways for you to access this digitally. Um, check it out, uh, the course, and then the, the digital appendices. And I hope that this idea serves your language class as well. Let me know how, how you get on if, if, if you try it this way with having them all printed out and ready for students.